their experiences that you go through you can't undo mm. the picture that circulated on Twitter showing that he had been stabbed if you've used fake blood it doesn't darken the way normal blood does. Blood darkens and it's spread on your skin. It, it should be pretty dark. He took a knife and he tried to cut me. We have your weapon that's been given to the police. A, file, a report has already been filed. The detectives are on the case. We had an incident today. Here is the nurse mate's building. I talked to the attendant that's working inside the gas station at this moment. She did say that there was no reports made and she had not heard anything about anybody being stabbed. These people, they come out, they're unable to debate with us academically, and they have no answer. So what do they do? They turn to this type of abuse, terrorism and violence. When I first heard this news, I wouldn't say I prophesized it, but I knew it was coming, which again makes perfect sense why Allah, when, well, Islam applies capital punishment to these individuals, because they would not leave the believers alone. And then they call us terrorists, they call us names, but they're, they're the ones that initiate. The surprise that I haven't told anybody is, uh, Alhamdulillah, he's been arrested. Alhamdulillah, he's been arrested. But Alhamdulillah, uh, I mean, I had given the knife to the police. They had his fingerprints and all that. Yeah, obviously, the video was there. And Look, when we zoom in, I've known several people who have been stabbed. And then it soaks their pants. Why? Because blood starts running down their body. Here we have no wound up top. We have a wound down at the bottom. And the blood somehow runs about eight inches up Sheikh Uthman's body. His blood miraculously flowed against gravity. If you look at the picture, you see blood spatters off to the left of the wound. And uh, you see little specks of blood everywhere. The spatters, spatters come from outside blood. That does not come from soaking from inside a garment. Sheikh Uthman was followed and the Sheikh was stabbed. Where is the outrage? I haven't seen a single one of these, you know, big Christian channels or personalities come out and condemn this and show support. You're going to get caught and know this, that you're a coward. You're a coward. You're a coward. I don't know why people do things like this. I don't know why people do things like this.